Hello, if this is your first time tuning in with me, I am Adina O'Neill of adinaoneill.com. I am a wife, a mom, triathlete, a coach, an entrepreneur, a dog mom, um, and a sister, a friend, just an everyday person trying to live their best life. And today I want to talk to you about the people in my life because the people is what makes it happen, right? Um, I, If you missed my first installment of this little story yesterday about why I created my business, you can go back and watch that. But today I wanna tell you about the people who I serve because I am here to serve you and that is where all the magic happens for me. Um, the people who I serve are everyday people they're people just like me, right? It's the people who think that they're too slow or too heavy or too skinny or too smart or too um, ugly or not fancy or they don't fit in or they don't know what to do, they don't have the skills and they just feel like they don't fit in because it really <laughs> sucks when you feel like you don't fit in. I know I've been there and I've been searching for a very long time for a place that I fit in and I actually ended up deciding to create a place that I fit in and where I can help other people who feel like they don't fit in just feel absolutely awesome about themselves because every ordinary person has it in them to become an extraordinary athlete and extraordinary is defined in a whole bunch of different ways you know if you're showing up for yourself then you're doing it and that's what really counts to me the people who are looking for encouragement guidance they say i want to do it but i just don't know how they say i'm doing it but i don't feel like i look like any of those other people that's where I was and I just kept showing up for myself. And basically, um, I realized that it did not really matter what any of those other people thought, what any of those other people looked like. I mean, let's face it, we live in a world where we can hop on to social media, we can hop onto the internet, and we can find versions of everything. And unfortunately, a lot of times, the versions of the people we're seeing who are out there doing triathlons, out there running races, maybe they don't look like you. And that's kind of where I was. I looked at this and I just said, well, those people don't look like me. I'm short. I'm overweight. <laughs> I have a big chest. Um, I'm not very fast. Um, I, you know, I just did not look like those people. And when you look at that and you see those are the people who are doing the stuff, you start to question whether or not you're the kind of person who can do the stuff. And I want to tell you that you are definitely the kind of person who can do the stuff. And you are the person that I want to help because there has been no greater feeling, personal feeling for my own self-worth than since I have been doing triathlons and endurance races and pushing myself to a limit that I never even knew exist and even beyond and trying things that I never thought I could do. And then turning that around and paying it forward to all the other Adinas out there. Yeah, there's not a lot of Adinas, but you know what I mean. All the other people who are like me out there who are saying, I could never do that. Are saying, I'm too slow. I don't have this. I don't know how to do that. I can't swim. I don't know how to run. I don't have a bike. I wouldn't know what to do even if I had all those things. And I just love seeing the transformation that happens with the people that I have been helping who start out saying, oh my gosh, I'm so scared of that and finish with a confidence that you just, you can't explain it. You can't explain it, but you see it in your face. You see it in the way they hold their bodies. 
you know, I'm still not a tiny person, but I walk with a different confidence just knowing that I can go out there and try these things and knowing that I can inspire you to go out there and try these things. So that's what it's about for me. It's about those people. It's about you, that you can go out you're a regular person and that's all you really need to get started. You don't have to be fancy. And you see the medals that are behind me? This is not some special person. Well, yeah, I'm special. Everybody's special. My mom told me I'm special. I'm sure your mom told you you're special. And if you didn't, I'm telling you now you're special. But it doesn't take anything other than just being a regular person to get out there and go for those medals. Like, That's what makes it extraordinary, in fact, is that you are just an ordinary person, just like me, and you can get out there, and you can try it, and you can earn those medals too. I did it, I've helped other people do it, and I would love to help you do it. And that's exactly what I'm doing. So those are the people that I serve. I get really excited about it because like that's that's why I'm here. Like I've realized that that is kind of that's my gift and you hear people talking about what their gifts are all the time, but my gift is to be able to help you get out there and find your own confidence and figure out which one of those medals you want to put on your own wall. But there's the thing, like, I can't just do it by myself. I didn't all of a sudden just wake up and was like, oh, yeah, I know how to run a business. And I sure can help people, but how do I pull that all together? And I am so, so super grateful for another community of people who are like me, kind of regular, everyday people who came together with ideas of people that they wanted to serve in different capacities. And we came together in a training course and learned how to turn our passion and our purpose into a real business. And I got to tell you, it is not easy. (laughs) It is not easy. But I am so thankful for the group of women. They're mostly women who I work with, actually. Um, But the group of women who have helped me. We help each other. We meet up on a regular basis and we cheer each other on. Uh, You know, sometimes you'll see me, you know, shouting people out on my page, on my stories, other entrepreneurs who are like trying hard and, um, you know, doing their best to serve the people that they are wanting to serve. So, I am thankful for all of you for being here, for supporting me. I am thankful for my group of entrepreneur friends who help support me every day and listen to me when I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing and how did I even get here? What do I do next? Um, it's, it's, it's it's all kind of the same journey, you know, fitness journey and a business journey is very similar. It's just like ups and downs and trying to figure out where you're going. So the last thing I want to say is that I couldn't do any of this without any of you. Um, it's, it's the people I serve who reflect back my passion, the people I serve who reflect back my energy, and who actually let me help them find their passion and their energy so that way together we can cross that finish line. So um, just know that I am cheering you on. Um, you know, without the people um, that I can help who are very much like me, um, without the people who are helping me so I can help them, um, and of course, without my family, um, you know, like everybody else, um, I'm, I'm just a regular person. I have a couple of teenagers. And I love them dearly, and sometimes they drive me nuts. Um, You know, I've been married for 20 years, and I have a fantastic husband. And funny, we don't really, like, fight a lot, but sometimes, well, we disagree. We raise our voice. It sends the dog running off to his crate. But, you know, I know he's always there for me and in my corner. So uh, the bottom line is it's all about people, and um, if... 
any of those people sound like you that you think you would like to work with me um, to start um, training for a triathlon or learning what that even means, then head over to adinaoneal.com, check out my website, slide into my DMs, and let me know what goal you're working on because I'd love to keep cheering you on. All right, have a fantastic day, and remember, always keep it real.